Hey there everyone, assalamu alaikum, I'm Nasmus and welcome to this video. In this video I'll show you how you can download Windows 8.1 without using a product key. So basically to do so, we'll need to go to this website provided to us by Microsoft. And I'll have the link of, to this website in the description, but let me just uh, put this on the, on the on screen for you right now, just if you want to uh, write it down or keep that in mind but I'll have the link in the description but what I'll here's the link I'm gonna let's let's increase the font size a little bit there you go so we have this so uh, I would say replace the in dot dash us to uh, the language of your version of the of the Windows uh, install installation you want to use but um basically this is the website and you could also do a Google search so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go to bing.com or google.com and you could search for create windows 8.1 8.1 recovery media and then you search for this and you will have this option this well, I mean I believe I believe it's this one um there it is create installation media for windows 8.1 and you click that and you should be you should arrive at the same website so here um, so basically what you want to do when you get to the website is we'll scroll down and click the purple button that says the color may vary by the time you're watching but basically the button that says create media or create media or similar text we click that and we'll be asked if we want to run or save the program I, you could save it or run it doesn't matter so I'll click save and then it should be done pretty quick after it runs the security scan click the run button and it should launch it should launch the installer so it says Windows just give it a wait a second so now it's it's asking what kind of installation media you want to create so basically we have the language here edition architecture select your language so um, I would use English United States nope not a spinal all right English United States and then addition you can use Windows 8.1 or Windows 8.1 Pro depending on the version of the OS you have I have Pro and sorry you could use architecture to download the 32-bit version or the 64-bit version download the one that's appropriate for your computer and I'll have another video that shows how to how to determine whether you have a 32-bit version or a 64-bit version of Windows. So for now, uh, for me, it's 64-bit, so I'll download the 64-bit version. Let's click Next. Now it's asking you how you want to install it. So the first option is USB drive. This basically uh, says save the install installation file to a USB drive with at least four gigabyte of space. Any info on the drive will be overwritten. And this option is save the installation file, save the installation file called an ISO to your PC and then burn it to DVD with at least four gigs of space. Uh, DVD burner is required for this part, this option. But um, so I'll choose an ISO file and you could keep it as a backup um, because if you choose an ISO file, you could keep that it's, uh, in your cloud backup or an external hard drive and burn it to a disk if you need to. You could even install Windows directly from an ISO file. I'll have another video showing you exactly how to do that. But let's choose US ISO file and let's click next. And then it'll ask you where you would like to save the file. I'll choose desktop. And then let's call it Windows 8.1 Pro. For because I have a Pro version. I'll click next save. So let's say it's going to download the installation file. And it says feel free to keep using your PC. So it's having estimated time for you um, and the percentage complete so what I'm going to do I'll return when this finishes downloading and we'll keep we'll we'll keep uh, we'll go on to the next step so uh, I'll see you in a bit hey then everyone and welcome back and it looks like our downloading is finished now you see an option that says or a dialogue that says burn the ISO file to a DVD make sure you have the product key when you're ready to install now to download the Windows 8 installation media it does not require a product key but when you go to install the OS it will require the product key so 
remember that I chose Windows 8.1 Pro. The reason is because I have a Windows 8.1 Pro product key. So make sure to download the language and the version of the OS for which you have the product key. And you could always buy a new product key if you don't have one. So let's click finish. Now remember you saved the uh, saved the file. I saved it on the desktop and I called it Windows 8.1 Pro. So just double click it and it should open the ISO. If you have Windows 7, you'll need an ISO mounter or you need to burn it to a DVD. But you could just double click the setup and click yes and the setup will launch it says preparing 97 percent okay now it says download and install updates recommended I'll choose no thanks for the speed for um, uh, to make it quicker for us click next it's checking your PC basically it says we're getting a few things ready so basically um, if your computer has m the reason it's not asking for a key for me is because I'm using this on a surface tablet and my surface tablet has a key embedded in the BIOS of the operating system so therefore it's not asking for a key but for you it might actually ask for a key and make sure you have the key ready but uh, once it's oh actually it, it is asking for a key so you'll actually need to type in the key so okay sometimes it does work on my surface and sometimes it's asked for a key for so go ahead and type in your key and click next and you should be able to install Windows 8.1 uh, I will have another video on how to do this um, to install Windows 8.1 using uh, your product key um, another thing to note before I go is you could actually use your Windows 8.0 key to install Windows 8.1 here so yeah so if, if we have a 8.0 or an 8.1 key you should be able to go ahead and complete the installation well, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please let us know in the comment below.